So, it is 6pm, which means it's time for Winter Wildcard Team 3, Icon Player Picks, Year in Review Player Picks, and 100 Player Picks for Winter Wildcards. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Ultimate Team Coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description, save 5% using code HABER. Winter Wildcard Team 3 is looking pretty spicy. We've got Garincha, we've got a centre-back Yashin card, which I guarantee will probably be absolutely insane. It'd be like Millie Savage from last year. Uh, Raul, Burkamp, Shearer... Sanchez, Cluza, and Lau to put right back. Then we've got Mo Salah at striker. We've got Gortoir at striker. Casemiro at striker. CDM Kunde, Dibinia, Gretzka, uh, Saliba, Adiemi, Lamptey, Renato Sanchez, who looks absolutely cracked off his mind. We have a pretty good team three here. I'm quite excited. I think the icons are pretty good. The uh, winter wildcards are pretty good. I have a relatively empty club as well. I've used pretty much all of my gold cards now. Bar maybe like a few 88s because I didn't have anything to put them into. So, basically EA, anything and everything is, is going to be class for my club. But also, if I, if I could get myself... If I can get my hands on like a Casemiro, for example, would be class. Um, failing that, I would settle for like a Shearer or a Garincha or a Yashin as well. Um, but Casemiro is the main target. Casemiro is the one we want. Renato Sanchez would be all right as well, I guess. Um, but Casemiro is the one we want the most, EA. So if we could please get Casemiro, that'd be great. Of course, we're going to be doing our year in review player picks, icon player picks and whatnot as well. So they'll be in the video too. I won't show you all 100 player picks because I'm not horrible like that. I'll see you guys when we pack something half decent, which is hopefully pretty soon. Casemiro being a striker kind of puts a dent in my plans. Two! We pack ourselves Cristiano Ronaldo. Sadly, not the Winter Wildcard version. Um, I have been packing walkouts. I've not shown you all the walkouts because I don't want to bore you guys to death with 86 rated cards. But these have been pretty good for fodder so far. We're yet to get a Winter Wildcard or an Icon. We've just been discussing how nice that Ian Wright SBC looks. It's a bit expensive, don't get me wrong. But five-star skills on the card as well. It looks very, very nice. I'm quite happy that EA are actually juicing some of the icon icons that are being released as SBCs. I'm hoping that Roy Keane gets a really, really nice, like, CDM card. Like, if I, if we get a very usable Roy Keane, I will be very happy. Because he'll be in my team for a very long time. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next big pool that we get from these player picks, which is hopefully soon. Kvalad Skellia. We have three more player picks of the first 50. So far, no Winter Wildcard. No Winter Wildcard icon. It's been just fodder at the moment, unfortunately. Which, I'm not complaining about too much, but... It's not been a great first 50. I will say that. So, hopefully, the second set of 50 is better than the first set. Oh! Oh, Junjo! I thought I got an icon. It, I swear that the tip of that card looks white, bro. Junjo Shelby. Well, if we're doing a Newcastle Paston Pineapple team, he'd definitely get in there. I'm not doing a Newcastle Paston Pineapple team. But if we were... He would definitely get in there. Left wing back, 99 pace. 15k maximum, I would say. Probably goes for about 11k. Um, at least we've packed a winter wild card, though. I swear the tip of that card genuinely looked white, though. I thought that was an icon. I thought we'd... I want Yashin. Yashin's the one I want the most, actually. That Yashin card looks absolutely... Why did I take Minule? I'm an idiot. That Yashin card actually looks fantastic. I'd love that Yashin card. All right. Last five. Of the 100 player picks, I do have an 85 plus player pick and a year in review coming right up. Then we'll have icon picks and whatnot as well. Um, I'm taking the non-dupes to make it as quickly as possible. I cannot be bothered with the dupes anymore. I'm just, yeah, I'm, I'm already over it. Um, can we end off with a winter wildcard or icon, please, EA? Doesn't look likely, does it? We've had one winter wildcard. It was 84 John Joe Shelby. He will be worthless, but at least we got one. All right, so now we're going to back out. Go back in, we should have our 85 plus player pick and year in review player pick along with like a couple of the loans, which I'm not going to sit there and, and make you watch. Oh, I didn't do the 85 plus player pick. No, I forgot I didn't do it. All right, we have my year in review player pick. Never mind. I didn't do my 85 plus player pick. Anyway, year in review player pick with icons involved. What do we get? I'll take Malcolm. I'm honestly not disappointed with that. I like building up a nice sort of group of Saudi league players in the club. You know, if I ever want to go and get a winter wild card Ronaldo, I've got a nice right winger that links to him. So we'll take that. All right, Lala's got two 87 plus base or Centurion icon picks now. The exciting 
part of this video, the icon picks. Here we go. It's okay. Eh. Rivaldo's eh. No, he's not. He's not. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not going to sit there. I need to stop doing this. It's a bad habit where I try and make it seem like it's good. It's not. That is quality though. Nemanja. Big Nemanja Vidic, who I imagine you probably don't want because he's lower rated. So I will uh, I'll just leave that for you to take just in case you don't want Nemanja. But Nemanja is great, mate. Nemanja is fantastic. Year in review or icon pick on my second account. Let's see what we get. Will we get a good player? You know what? I don't know. I, uh, I keep doing this to myself and I don't know why. I don't know who I thought that was. I don't know who I thought Clivert was. But I didn't get whoever I thought I'd got. I don't know who that was. But we've got ourselves Santos as well. No, she's pretty terrible. And Alvano Negredo. I'm going to take Cliver for the fodder. And he will be put into another SBC along with uh, De Bruyne and Royce. All right, we have got Rob's year in review slash icon player pick. Let's see what we get. Come on, EA. It's late at night. He's just built it. He's asked me to open it. Let's see what we get. Malcolm's not bad, actually. Malcolm's decent. I've heard good things about this Neville card as well, but I'm not going to lie. I personally wouldn't take it just based on the trim. Um, but Malcolm's not a bad card. All right. 500k pack for Winter World Card Team 3. There is an icon in this pack. So we're starting off with a Hubendish. 89, 80, 89 rated. Icon, though. Fernando Hierro. Is he, is he part of Team 3? Which, which, which team is Fernando Hierro part of? I don't really know. Anything else in that pack, though? Hiero is kind of boring. 99 defending, whatever. Any winter wild cards at the back of this pack, though, EA? Come on. Show us winter wild cards, please. We want to see winter wild cards. Not looking promising. Surely not. Really? Not a single winter wild card? That's boring. All right. Another 87 plus icon pick right now for Ewan. Is this how we're starting off, yeah? Is this how these icon player picks are going to go, yeah? Brilliant. All right, I built both icon picks on my main account now, EA. I have Dino and Miaham tradable that I've had since nearly the start of the game. So if I pack either of those and tradable, I'll be very, very excited. Let's go. Let's see what we get. First one. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Okay. Well, uh, I think I'll take Petit. Next one. Come on, EA, please. Come on. Hmm. Okay. Ah. Uh, ha. Huh. Less than ideal. I'm going to take Baresi for the fodder. That, that could have gone a lot better. That could have gone a lot better. All right. Now I'm going to open up the Supreme Icebreaker pack on my own account. We'll see what we get. 3,500 FC points. 70 rare golds, 83 or higher. With a 77% chance of a winter wild card and 11% chance of a winter wild card icon. Here we go. Let's see what we get. We do have something. It's an inform. We've got ourselves Ruben Diaz. So that's back to back Ruben Dish in both packs. And an inform behind him. Oh. 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 Okay, then. 92 in Form Haaland. I mean, he's only 200k, but like, oh. Okay. I just wasn't expecting that. Nice. Very nice. Oh. Nice. Five in Forms, including Haaland. I think we might have a winter wild card in this pack because the player picks aren't here. I think when the player picks are at the back of the pack, it means there's a winter wild card in there. Palizzi, eh? Come on. Casemiro. Come on. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Wait, what, what playstyle plus has he got? Performs even higher jumps and has greatly improved aerial physical presence. 99 agility and balance, 99 reactions, 99 composure, 99 shot power. Finishing could do with a bit of work. Maybe a hunter on this card. 99 strength, 99 jumping. This card looks absolutely ridiculous. And he's half a million coins. 
I'm just going and getting Trent at right back. And like whoever else at left back who's got like crossing. And I'm going to score every header. <laughs> That's, this pack was insane. This pack was absolutely insane. Wow. What a, what a worth it pack that was for me. All right, two more icon picks now on my second account. That store pack was wild, by the way. If that doesn't deserve a like, I don't know what does. Here we go. I'll take Didier. Didier is actually not terrible. I don't know if he's still worth a little bit. Yeah, he's still worth like 300k. I mean, oh, he's, not, he's worth like 200k. I mean, we'll still take it. All right, second one. I don't know why. Got really excited when I saw that. Then I realized that she's actually awful. But, do you know what? I mean... Eh... No. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to pretend it was good. All right. Now, my boy, Cridian's two icon player picks next. Here we go. Zola's not bad. It's just like... I feel like he's becoming a little bit behind the power curve now. So, Raul is also pretty decent. The thing is, Raul is a very similar card to, to Zola as well. It's just higher rated. I think a bit better. We'll take Raul. Second one now. Here we go. What are we saying? That is, that is brutal. Is that a dupe untradeable? That is actually brutal. That is actually brutal. That's, that's a dupe untradeable. Oh, that is brutal, man. What is Zizu actually worth? Zinedine Zidane's 94 rated icon card is worth 1.7 million. That, I feel a little bit sick. I hate when this happens, man. How does this even happen, EA? Awful. All right, 85 plus player pick and two base or Centurion icon picks. No winter wild card in the 85 plus pick. It's going to be a trend. All right, here we go. Come on. Come on, EA. Let's get another Zizu, but... Actually, no, wait. I think he's already got Zizu. I mean, that stinks anyway. Cassias or Swiney, I think. I feel like you just go Cassias for the fodder. He's got a very, very good team. He's, you have to get a top-tier icon to even get into his team. So, you know. Really? Really? Back-to-back -back Schweinsteigers. Really? I just feel like that's out of order. Back to back Schweinies is terrible, EA. Oh, wait, purple? What is this? You got an Osserman. Double walkout. Oh, it's a triple threat. I don't even remember who's in the triple threat team. It was like, it feels like it was so long ago, I kind of forgot. Jack, Jack Good Eilish. He's got Jack Good Eilish. Oh, and an inform. That's actually a really good 83 times 10, to be fair. You take that. That is actually really solid. I don't know if the 83 Tom Sens are still out or not. I feel like I'm I'm going to regret not building the last three. Second one is not going to be a special card. But, obviously, uh, Winter Wild Card short behind walkouts. So, it could still be a cheeky little uh, cheeky little Winter Wild Card there. Oh, they are still out? All right, perfect. I'm going to build some on my account then. Um, who's that? Ruben Diaz. He's been really popular in packs today. I feel like I've packed Ruben Diaz a lot today. Uh, sadly, not going to be anything spectacular in that. All right. Come on. Third and final 83 by 10. Can we get a winter wild card or winter wild card icon? He's doing 85 times two first. No winter wild card or icon in this one. It's going to be Robertson as the first player, which means double walkout. Double walkout. He skipped it. Hey, I mean, hey, if you know, if you support Liverpool, I don't think he supports Liverpool. I'm going to take that as a, that he does not support Liverpool. He's got a United badge. Love it. United. Come on. All right. Here we go. No special card again. Spain right back. Wait. Is that a walkout? I don't think it is, is it? Own a battle. Yikes. All right. We have another icon player pick. Here we go. What are we saying? Centurion's in there. He's not a bad card. And I'm not just doing that thing where I say, oh, it's not bad. It's actually not a bad card. That card's actually pretty good. You take that. 83 times 10 now. Could be potentially a Cobell double walkout with a winter wildcard behind. Not a double walkout. Would a winter wildcard still be behind that? Yes, it will. You got John Joe Shelby again. Nice to see you. He who shall not be named. All right. La La's Supreme Icebreaker pack now. Let's see if it's as lucky as mine. 
Well, you don't get an inform or a special card on the front. So another Ruben Diaz, though. Instantly, it's not as lucky as mine. Another Ruben Diaz, though. 77% chance of a winter wildcard. We're hoping there's a, a winter wildcard behind here. Kevin De Bruyne. You got a double man city walkout again. As horrible as that is. Um, what else is behind this then? So you got three informs. Mitchie Batshuayi, Providel, and Demaral. And the player picks are there, which means there's no winter wildcard, doesn't it? I'm pretty sure. I mean, we could put this theory to the test real quick. But I'm pretty sure it means there's no winter wildcard. Unless it's a duplicate. No. Wow. Yikes. 77% chance and 1 in 3. Really, EA? Really? We are going to end off this video with Dan the Goon and Supreme Icebreaker Pack to see if we can get ourselves something decent to end it off. If you guys have enjoyed, please make sure to leave a like down below. No special card again. I'm not happy. Rodri. Just all Man City walkouts, isn't it? Just all Man City. If that's De Bruyne again, or if that's a Ruben Diaz, I'll be fuming. Just De Bruyne. Stop giving me these Man City walkouts, man. Be a winter wildcard, please. Please. Igor Tiago from Club Brugge. What we got? Okay, no player picks, which means there's a winter wildcard in here. Lamptey. I don't think this card looks bad at all, by the way. No way he's that much short. Is he actually over 100k? Wow. This card actually looks pretty decent. Three-star skills, five-star weak foot. Um, he's got the long throwing uh, play style plus, but he's got great agility and balance, really good defending stats, great pace. Yeah, solid. I mean, that's not bad at all, to be fair. If you guys have enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new around here. Thank you for watching. I'll see you lads later.